good morning guys it is thursday march 9th just got to the gym i've only got two clients this morning and then bryce is coming in today's actually a recovery day for him but he's like you know what i'm gonna come in anyway and you know let's just hit something easy let's just do we're just gonna put an arm day video out there for you guys i know we've done like legs and back and things like that but we haven't done arms yet so I'm gonna hit arms today and do abs and then and definitely enjoy the day it's supposed to be like 75 degrees today which is awesome because in like two days it's supposed to be it's supposed to be like 39 and snowing so definitely gonna take advantage of today but let's get it started that's the day there we go First good set there, huh? Yeah, so first exercise, I'm just gonna go straight curling in that squat rack, baby. Shh. Curling in Drape the squat rack. Let's just do, let's just hit 10 to 12, four sets, and then we'll do one tricep exercise, like real heavy, maybe close grip bench. Four Quite sets. Real. Remember that. This is 220, this is 225 plus the clamps. So, it's like clamp for safety. Wouldn't want that falling. Oh, we're going for 10 here. Don't worry about spotting me if it drops in my face. No. Footage is way more important. It'd be cooler. You gotta tough it out. Cooler to get the drop on face. <sighs> Strain. That looks fun. Yeah. yeah. It was. Thanks to my man Henry. Shout the out. Neon shout sign. out Henry. Dude, Where's seven, Henry? I think he's like. He's over there in the orange. Henry's easily 75 and probably can outrun everyone here on the treadmill. Miles. He wears jorts and lugs <laughs> for workouts. Who's the boss? Strict by. Well, you want to make sure you lean back. The strict bicep. Let that bicep stretch. Anyway. So different angles, huh? I like it. I can do some different angles here. Aerial. Right, we'll go back to the normal. Like from the Little Mermaid. Aerial, the Little Aerial. Mermaid. Oh, that's a good one. Hard? After you do, after you do enough, it is. Oh, jeez, it's scary. All right, so we're gonna do a little voiceover here for you guys. Kind of explain what we're doing a little bit more than just watching it out here, just because the music was kind of bad and everything. But what we got here is a skull crusher with using single dumbbells or dumbbells uh, in each hand, just making sure each hand lifts its own individual weight instead of using that straight bar. Focus on a good stretch and a good flex at the top. All right, then we moved over to a supinated grip, which is just your palms facing up with, uh, on the preacher curl here, we're doing four sets of 20, and we were supersetting it with the seated tricep extension on the preacher bench uh, as well, which is actually right behind where I'm sitting. So I think this is me hitting the third set or so of 20. And then I flipped over and did these, um, but we got Bryce doing them here. So the main thing is just focusing on um, good, good, good stretch, good flex, trying to force blood into the muscle. Um, finishing the last two exercises that we did with these superset style, just trying to get that pump feeling after we lifted some heavier weight earlier in the workout. Right here, what we did is a um, another supinated grip, what we would call now a reverse grip on the tricep extension. It seems to hit the uh, back head of the tricep a little bit more than the outer head. 
So I was having wrist issues though, so I did flip back over um, and do the overhand grip. And we were supersetting it with hammer curls. Um, just because we didn't do anything at all to hit the brachialis, everything we did curl-wise was supinated. We didn't have any rotation or anything like that. Um, so we wanted to do some hammer curls to finish up. This is actually the last bicep exercise we did. Uh, I think this is uh, our actually our, la our third to fourth set. So that's that, guys. Appreciate you watching. All right, guys. We got arm day in. And I hate that lighting in the gym. It gives terrible... F Terrible glare, but you know, we did the best we could. Um, gave you some highlights of that. Now we're about to head to the house. Cannon's not feeling good today. See you, bud. Cannon's not feeling good today, so take care of him. Uh, see how he's doing. Possibly do my cardio outside, just taking him on a walk. We go over, we go almost two miles, over 30 minutes, so just steady state. But like I said, we're gonna enjoy the day. As you can see, it is beautiful out, and it is about. 75 degrees, so I'm gonna enjoy that. You feeling okay? You got daddy's RSP bottle? Hey, Bricks. All right, so just got home. He seems to be feeling okay. I got him to eat a little bit. Got him to drink some water. So hopefully we're gonna, it's nice out. Like I said, we're gonna go take a walk in a second. Um, I wanna show you my lunch, nothing special. It's literally the Sriracha Lime Chicken I talked about a couple of videos ago, a um, little bit about, 15 to 20 carbs worth of brown rice, sriracha sauce on it, and then one of these um, Velveeta 2% milk, half the fat cheese cups. So you're looking at 30 carbs from that, 15 to 20 from that, so maybe 50 carbs, getting a little bit of protein, minimal fat. Um, so not something that you would typically think that you could eat to get lean, but um, I'll do follow that if it fits your macros or flexible dieting format and what that means um, is basically if it fits in your macronutrients that you're allowed for the day your 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 total number of carbs fats and proteins that you can eat in a total day then you can eat it so if you can fit the mac and cheese in if you can fit a slice of pizza in if you can fit whatever in you can have it as long as you stay within your limits each day all right so that's what that's about cannon ready to go for a walk get you some water i like that georgia bulldog cup buddy all right, he's on the move. Soon enough, he's gonna be walking by himself. All right, buddy, let's go outside.